my new hair. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another vlog. I feel like it's been forever since I've sat down and just like vlogged with you guys. Um, my past two vlogs have been like from traveling and events and just not like a normal me and you type vlog if that makes sense. So today we have something very exciting. It is August 15th and I am chopping off my hair. If you guys have been with me for a while, one of the first videos on my channel that blew up was me chopping off my hair. I want to say it was like two years ago. Let's look it up really quick. Okay, so I just pulled up my channel on my computer really quick. Where is it? It's way down here. Oh my god, this is crazy. Dun, dun, it's coming up right here. Oh, it's only one year ago. I cut my hair. So if you guys remember, like this is one of my first videos. I used to have like insanely long hair all through high school. Oh my god, this is embarrassing. Like, look how long my hair was. It was long and I had a lot of highlights. Wow, that editing style, Emily. <laughs> and then I chopped it really, really short. Like, as short as it's ever so been in my life. Hold on, let's let it skip. So then I literally chopped it. I'm sure I'm gonna let you guys know, update you guys, and make a short hairstyle video. Which I never did, because um, I suck. So that's me. It says a year ago. Let's see the actual date and when I uploaded that video. Come on, computer. What are you doing? So I uploaded that on November 8th of 2016. Okay, so that's almost two years ago. That's what I thought. That's what I'm doing again today. I haven't cut, like, drastically cut my hair since that time. I mean, I get it trimmed all the time and dyed and all that kind of stuff, um, but I haven't completely chopped it. And if you guys watched one of my more recent vlogs, when I dyed my hair, because I had highlights in it, I'd done a lot of like lightening to my hair, and then I kind of wanted to go back to my roots, because you guys can tell I have very really dark features, like my eyebrows are my natural hair color. Um, so my hairstylist dyed it back really, really dark, but she kept doing kind of like tints, so it slowly fades. So today, we are permanently dyeing it dark because I know I like the dark hair. Um, and then we're chopping it. Like, I think above my shoulders. I don't really know. I'm going to let her decide. You guys have met her before. I've talked about her before. Village Parlor. Nicole at Village Parlor. I'm going to put all the info on the screen. They are incredible. And I'm super excited today because when I got my hair cut the first time, it was done at Ulta. And she did a fabulous job. But... Nicole is just like, I literally trust her with my life. She could do anything to my hair and I know I would love it. So I'm really excited to see what she does today. They're definitely more like a fashion hair salon, if that makes any sense. A little bit more high end and just, I know she's going to do a great job and make it look really, really cute. And she's amazing because she helps me style it too because I suck at styling my hair. And when I first told her like, Nicole, I want to chop my hair. Let me chop my hair. She's like, you can chop your hair, but you need to learn how to style it before I chop it because it's definitely like a different way of getting used to styling it because otherwise I'll just straighten it every day um so that's what's up I'm at my office now it's like 10 o'clock in the morning my appointment is at 11 30 and actually my salon is in West Village which is literally down the street from my office so um Kelly's actually coming with me so I'm waiting for her she's gonna meet me here and then we're gonna drive over to Village Parlor and that's what's up I'm super excited, like really, really excited. I cannot wait and I want to take you guys with me. Um, this vlog might go into the weekend because I think I'm doing like a shoot on some boat this weekend, which will be kind of cool. I don't know, if not, this will just be all about my hair. And like to me, because I've had really long hair, this isn't even that long to me because my hair used to be like literally down to my belly button. Um, but I think we're chopping it like and I'll put up some inspo pics, like ones that I used. Um, and then I'll also try and get like information of what Nicole's actually doing to me. Because I know I had a lot of questions last time, like what color she used on me. But I have no idea. Um, so I can ask her. So while I wait for Kelly, I have a bunch of work to do. And I have like a lot of scheduling. I have so many like appointments and weird events and dates coming up that I have like written down on all different platforms. Cause I get like dates and information sent in my DMs, then in my emails and then text message and phone calls and 
um, all this kind of stuff. So I really need to sit down and write it all down in my planner because I feel like I have some overlapping dates and I need to make sure all my timing is correct. Plus I'm going out of town next month. So I need to figure all that out. But what I wanted to get to kind of segue into with me working um, is if you guys haven't seen my vlog, I vlogged when I got my new office, which is where we're sitting now if you're a little confused. I had a lot of questions on what my office is for and why I got an office. And I am only 19 if you guys don't know that. So my office is for everything EJB and EJB is Emily Jean Beauty, which is my brand, my company, my YouTube, all that kind of stuff. So that is what my office is for. You can see my little letters up there. I needed a place to separate like my normal life with like just EJB because I'm really trying to like sit down and focus on this brand that I'm working on. Um, and I know it's like kind of confusing when you say brand. It's just like branding myself and branding my name as far as my YouTube and my modeling and brand influence. And then I'm bringing out merch. I'm working on something else that's top secret right now, but super excited. <laughs> so um, you guys can kind of tell there's so much going on within like this one Emily Jean Beauty category where I needed my own dedicated space to like come here and work like an eight hour shift day so i don't have another like actual corporate job obviously because i don't even have a degree and yeah i work at like a boutique i work at little places here and there just to make like some extra money on the side but my main job is emily jean beauty and that is all with you guys on youtube so backstory what i want to say is i've been getting my office more and put together and from the last time you saw it, there's definitely more stuff in here and it's much cleaner but i have a lot more to do so once it keeps like getting really dark um once it is completely done i'm gonna do like a full office tour explaining where everything i got everything from and decor pieces and like how i set it up um so you guys can see that because I know I love that and I also have never done a room tour and I actually have two bedrooms because my parents are divorced so I want to do that too I've been working I mean my my room at my dad's house is pretty much like done technically I just don't I'm not there that often and the room at my mom's house has just been a work in progress ever since I was a baby literally I'm always changing stuff up and mixing things around um, but I did just buy a bunch of furniture from Ikea so that video will be coming soon I just want to say that's what's going on. That's what this space is. You guys are going to be seeing me a lot in here with the vlogs, with all my filming. A lot of my filming is going to be in here. And since I have this big window here, I think this will be like my background because I have like the cute posters with the light and my plants. Um, so that's the plan. And I also have these rods hung up here for my merch coming soon. And yeah, I'm almost at 100,000 subscribers, guys. And I'm thinking that's going to be my next launch date for my merch. Because if you guys have been following me, my original merch date was supposed to be when I hit 50,000 subscribers. But that time literally came like three months too early. <laughs> so now, like my original date was like end of summer fall and that's when i thought i was gonna hit 50k but i'm way past that so i probably will hit 100k around that time so hopefully my merch can be done by then um the biggest thing that i'm just trying to work on is international shipping which has been a huge problem for me if you guys have any like um tips or helpful anything leave them down in the comments because i don't know how i'm gonna go international right off the bat i might have just to keep it north american um for my first launch it is extremely expensive and it just doesn't really make sense to do international but i know so many like 50 percent of you guys are international followers and i want to give back to you guys and i want this to be accessible to everyone but that's really what's holding me back right now just because i need to figure all those details out and see if i can make that happen um but at the same time i just want to get my merch out there in general so we'll see what happens I have to stop rambling. Again, I just feel like I haven't talked to you guys in so long and I love just sitting here talking to you. So I'm gonna drink my coffee. I have my breakfast sandwich right here and do some scheduling. So I'll see y'all at the salon. <laughs> Yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't know what made me decide this. But it's happening. So wait, how does this work? Okay, we'll see it. Trying to come back out here. <laughs> You're a model for today. Like, sure. Was it meant to be this side? probably got to show you my hair um, just because I was filming in there doing a little time lapse and then we had to hurry out because Kelly needed to get somewhere and we went and grabbed lunch um, but now I'm back at my office I spilled coffee all over my white dress so I did change um, the white dress and this dress are from rococomi.com I will put a link down below for them um, and I also have a code for you guys I think I'm gonna be filming a whole haul with a bunch of stuff from there because they're having like a summer sale so if you guys just want to wait for that I'll be coming next week on Friday I believe um, or wait no that will be up before this yeah that will be up before this so by the time you're watching this, you guys can watch that haul video. I'll put the link down below for that because um, there's a bunch of really cute pieces in it. And I love this little dress. So this is my hair. I love it. It's so cute. Um, it's definitely like shorter than I imagined because like I know I really like my hair here. But I told Nicole like if we're going to cut it, we might as well just cut it like as short as possible. And then once it grows, you know, so we just went for it. It looks so cute. I feel like I have like no hair and the back is super short. So that's what happened. I'm back at my desk working. Um, I did a lot of my scheduling already. It gets so dark back here. I did a lot of my scheduling already and then I was supposed to shoot with one of my favorite photography photographers, Esther, um, but she isn't off work yet. So girl, where are you? But yeah, that's the plan. I'm gonna work here for a little bit longer. I'm gonna go home, eat dinner with my dad. Yeah, that's it. I guess the biggest thing is that my hair is literally chopped off. Let me know down below what's the craziest thing you guys have done to your hair. And let me know if you like my short hair or my long hair better. Because I know when I dyed my hair, everyone loved the dark hair. So now we did the same dye on it, but then we chopped it too. So let me know. And also let me know, okay, I'm curious. Some people say I look younger and some people say I look older. So I don't know if I look older or younger. So leave a comment down below if you were to guess how old I am with my hair short. How old do you think I look? Ready? Okay, I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, so 
so I've been working for a few hours now. Um, I'm about to head home to get some dinner with my dad, but I am going to continue this vlog into the weekend. Tomorrow I have a client and I'm going to a concert tomorrow night, so I might show that. And then this weekend I just have a ton of stuff. I might be doing like a live broadcasting for GMC Buick. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, and then Sunday I'm going on a boat photo shoot, so that will be really, really fun. I just got that locked in as far as times. Go for the night because I have been worked out and that's what's up. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so I'm currently editing this vlog right now. It's about a week later since I've cut my hair. Um, I know in the vlog I said I was gonna like vlog through the weekend. That never happened. I was just so insanely busy that I didn't even have time to be vlogging. I'm currently at the boutique I work at and I'm about to close up, but I just wanted to say what's up and sorry for not vlogging for the rest of the weekend. Um, I am uploading this tonight and today is Friday. So normally I have a normal main channel video on Friday and my vlogs are normally on on Wednesdays but I didn't have a video for today so we're gonna do the vlog and I decided to do my hair one because a lot of you guys have been asking for that and it makes sense because the video that was supposed to go up today would have had my hair already chopped off before the vlog where you saw my hair chopped off if that makes any sense so hair vlog today and then this upcoming Monday, I will have like a final summer haul for you guys from the store that I work at. Um, and then Wednesday will be another vlog. And then Friday will probably be like a get ready with me because I've had so many people asking for that. So that's what's up. I asked you guys to leave me a request on my Instagram for video requests. So I have so many I'm going to be filming soon and I want to get back into filming more makeup videos. Um, but just to clarify, because I did change my uploading schedule, I post every Monday, Wednesday, Friday around 3 p.m. if I'm on time and every Wednesday are vlogs and then Monday and Fridays are like main channel videos, so either makeup or hauls or like a sit down videos. So, yeah. So, instead of seeing you through this weekend, because already weekend already passed, I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.